Hey guys, my name is Scobie and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to change your Xbox Series S or X from light to dark mode or vice versa. This is going to be a nice quick and easy tutorial. I'm going to be showing you step by step how to do everything. Let's jump right into this. So the first thing you need to do is of course have your Xbox turned on, have a controller connected. We're going to be clicking the Y button on our controller and we're going to be searching for settings. Once your setting options opens up, what we're going to be doing is clicking on it right here and we're going to be brought to our Xbox settings. From this point, we're going to be selecting the top selection here on the left general. We're going to be coming over here to the top right option personalization. We're going to select this open. Once we're here, we're in our personalization settings. We can change a couple things about our Xbox. We're going to be scrolling down here until we see theme and motion. If we select this open, the very first option here will be theme. And if we click this open, we will have the choice between dark, light and scheduled. So if you want to switch directly between light and dark mode, you can select that here. And now your Xbox will be in light mode. However, you'll also have the option to click schedule. And here you can choose to set it up by sunrise and sunset times. So if you only want light theme during the day and then at nighttime, you want to switch back to dark theme, this can be a good option. Or if you want to do it by sunrise and sunset, you can also set it up like this. I think this is a really good option depending on what you're trying to do. And it gives a lot of flexibility here. So for today's video, I'm actually going to be leaving it on sunrise and sunsets. I think it's a really nice option to have. And it's as easy as that to change between light and dark theme. Now I will mention there is one other option here in the team in motion settings we have smooth transitions and it basically makes the transitions on your xbox a little bit smoother it's something i would definitely recommend keeping enabled however if it makes it feel a bit jarring or something like that you can feel free to turn it off here it's really easy to set up and it'll make animations a little snappier however i like the smooth transitions between things for me it looks a little bit better anyway guys it's as easy as that to switch between light and dark team on your xbox series s or your xbox series x if you guys enjoyed this tutorial, be sure to drop a like. Subscribe if you're new, check out the other videos on the channel. I'm going to be leaving a link down below to my PayPal if you found these videos helpful and you want to support me. Anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, as always, keep it saucy. Peace.